looking for hunting information and opportunities for D13. In this video, we're going to go over the number and types of tags that can be used for D13, the national forest for this zone, the weather and hunting conditions, camping information, the harvest stats and percentage killed the last several years, and finally regions to go for easy access to find deer. D13 is an unrestricted tag, and the Department of Fish and Game give out about 4,000 tags for this area. They're basically over-the-counter tags. There's also a premium muzzleloader tag, M7, in which 150 tags are given out. This is an either-sex tag. This starts the last Saturday of November. It runs for 16 consecutive days. D13's main forest is in the southern portion of the Los Padres National Forest. In the Los Padres National Forest, there's also a lot of little scattered private areas. So it would be wise to get on X hunt in order to make sure that you keep out of private property. Weather and hunting conditions. The weather can be from the mornings from the mid 20s to the mid 80s in the afternoon time. So make sure you wear layers. It will be hot and dry, so bring plenty of water. I bring about two liters of water for each hunt in the morning and the afternoon. I'd probably go through about three liters a day. The terrain is steep and rocky and with dense vegetation. Hunting at D13, you'll have intermittent cell signals, so you won't always be able to call somebody. John and I recommend a satellite communicator like Zoldio. John reviews it in this video here. It is a great option. The vegetation is mainly sage, oak, manzanita brush, and pine trees. Remember while you're out there, consider having Onyx Hunt, satellite communicator like Zolio, plenty of water, and good boots. Camping information. There are a number of campgrounds within D13. Some have running water, some do not. So be prepared to bring water to washing up. Camping outside designated campgrounds is permitted. However, during hunting says to check with the U.S. Forest Service website for fire regulations. There have been several times during opening weekend where you couldn't even use a Coleman stove. Harvest stats and percentage killed. The average harvest stat over the, the last several years has been about 11 to 12 percent. 2021 and 2020 were an exception where it was very low. 2021, there was very few deer taken that opening weekend. You can see the video here, we were talking about it. Now here's what you've been looking for. Places you can go to, with easy access, you can find deer. There are many roads into D13. The primary roads into D13 are Interstate 5 at Fraser Park Road and highways 33, 126, and 166. You'll connect into Forest Service roads in order to get into D13. These roads are Cuddy Valley Road, and Mills Palmero Highway, Lockwood Valley Road, Fraser Park Mountain Road, Piero Canyon Road, Good Enough Road, and Squaw Valley Road. Areas you're looking to hunt in the north there are Al Alamo Mountain, as it shows here, Alpine Canyon, Volunteer Canyon, Fraser Mountain. Camp Marin, Dome Springs, and Qualtar Canyon. In the south, places you want to look for is Pine Mountain, McDonald Peak, Lake Piro, Sespe Creek, yeah, and the Yell Jacket Trail. Hope this helps you find deer this season to D13, and good luck hunting. If you like videos like this, hit that subscribe button and hit the like button. Leave a comment below what you're hoping to, to do this season, and I'll see you out there in the woods.